everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 21 of Let's Play Axiom Verge, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, boyos and gallows, this is it. Gallows, that's a terrible thing to say. Glad you all hung around, no pun intended. It's time to take on the final boss of the game and finish this. So, it's you. Yes, I've been wondering when you'd come. It's been a long time since I've seen another human. What is this contraption you're in? Are you okay? It protects me from the pathogen. I previously used a much more portable device, but the Rizalki destroyed it. This ungainly machine merely prolongs my demise. Is it true that you released the pathogen on the whole world? Intentionally? Yes. Then you'd better do some explaining. If I tell you too much, your captors will have to kill you. But try this. Long ago, this world, Sodra, was the doorway to an unrivaled civilization. Like a port on the way to the greatest nation ever envisioned, but the port had a collapse. By the time I came, they barely remembered who they were. They regarded their own technology with superstition and religious reverence. When I first crossed the breach from Earth to Sudra, I was expecting to find enlightenment. Instead, I discovered that they were using the breach to keep out the greater universe. In their superstitious culture, the outside universe is taboo. For this, I do not regret removing the main obstacle in my path. You'd resort to genocide just for that? Imagine millennia as scientific, cultural, and technological progress. A civilization so advanced that our world is paleolithic by comparison. That is what lies beyond the breach. Death, disease, war, famine. These could become things of the past. But the Sujans were obstinate. This was the forbidden fruit. The loss of a single people balanced against the whole of humanity. How else could I choose? Well, you did it. You have the breach attractor now. Why not just shut it down? The Rizalki were the flaw in my plan. They are masters of war. If I disable the breach attractor, I free them too. But Trace, with you at my side, we have a chance. Will you help me? Hmm, let me think about that for a bit. Okay, I've thought about it. And my answer is... Hell no, you self-righteous jerk. So be it then. Alright, final boss, let's do this. Alright, your main weakness is actually this machine right over here. Okay, these guys can be very annoying. So you have to use your flamethrower on that square over there. And these pods will try to do a nice number on you. Now the good news is, if you're low on health and destroy them, there's a chance you can get some health back. Also, Elsa Nova will periodically help you to help destroy this machine. So every now and then, that square is going to return, and you have to do the same thing again. These pods, however, will keep trying to attack you, so if you're teleporting, you might have a good chance of dodging them. Like, every time you kill these machines, they will come back. So use that to your advantage if you're low on health. Like, if you're really low, just leave health around on purpose, and then you just come back and grab it, and you're pretty much, like, going to win, regardless. Like, just hold the fire button, that's all you need to do. Like, did I really need 100% of everything to win this? There, we did it! I'll just recover all my health anyway. So, it appears I have lost. Elsa Nova, we did it. The breach is gone. I'm sorry, but there is one more thing I need to do. You're going to kill him, aren't you? He can't do anything now. Just leave him. Unfortunately, that's not a chance we can take. This was inevitable, Trace. Do not blame yourself. Athatos. Oh, 
Well, I, you pretty much had to die. So that's it. I'll never know if... I mean, what if you could have been redeemed? Trace, you are not him. He chose wrongly, not you. But now it is time for you to go home. Go home? As a clone of a mass murderer? What's even there for me? Do not worry. We have taken care of it. What's happening? I'm suddenly exhausted. Rest now. Perhaps we'll meet again sometime? Wait, please. Oh, I got the achievement for sparing the boss. As for what happened next... I was back, but this was different. It was as if nothing ever happened. The laser lab had still collapsed, but I was uninjured, and nobody else seemed to think that was strange. I didn't stick around much longer. I tried to go back to my former life, but it felt wrong. I didn't know who I was anymore, or where I belonged. Oh, what a small house! How the hell did you live in there? I had to get back to Sudra, to find the truth of things. I started with what I learned there. I was determined to get to the bottom of it. That was all I had left. To the point my sideburns grew as long as it could. To the point they thought it was Wolverine. And that's it! That's Axiom Verge for the PC! Let me tell you, this was actually a very fun game to play. I mean, sure it had its mishaps, by the way, because of, you know, the game, like, you know, overheating my computer a couple times. And the game itself actually crashing pretty far in the game, of course. But either way, it didn't take away from the fact that this game is actually a must-play if you're into the Metroidvania series. Or even if you're not, this is a good game to play in general that I would highly recommend to anyone, whether it's on the PC, the PS4, or even on the Wii U. At least with the Wii U, you can look at the map with the gamepad, which they say is actually the best version you can play it on. So if you're going to play it on anything, I recommend it on the Wii I mean, sure, you won't get achievements, but do they really matter that much? Maybe for you, or someone else, but not so much for me. Either way, I would recommend it. So what is my next Let's Play after this? I actually have no idea. But I guess we'll find out soon enough, now will we? So, this is the Bonga signing off saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I shall see you next time.
honestly, those were not bad stats for like a mostly blind playthrough. I've almost got it. Just a bit more. Who's there? Athatos? There's no use running from your own self. Time to wake up, Trace. Tell him to wake up by shooting him. Don't they usually just go to sleep forever when that happens? <laughs> Alright, so I guess that's the end of the, end of the game. See ya.